Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel, We're the Movie Couple. I'm Wendy. And I'm Dustin. And we're about to watch the trailer for The Devil All the Time. This stars Tom Holland, Robert Pattinson, just to name like the two, but there's so many more. Jason I think there's Clarkson. also, um, um, Sean, um, oh no, what's his name? Uh, um, mm hmm Ah, shoot, no. Um, uh, Winter Soldier. Oh, Sebastian, Sebastian. Stan. I was like, S a stand? S Sebastian <laughs> Stan, sorry. I don't know why I added the D. Uh, Bill Skarsgård, I believe, isn't it? And uh, like a ton of other people. And this is, I believe, is a thriller. Um, and all I know is that it's based on, adapted from Donald Ray Pollock's award-winning novel, Ooh. So it's, I feel like, God, that's just like adding so much more content to like that I have to absorb. I literally just started a new audiobook and this was not it. Had I known, I would have maybe switched, but it's okay. Let's just go ahead and jump in yeah. and watch Tom Holland and Robert Pattinson together. That's really, really cool. Happy birthday, Happy birthday Tom Holland, oh. Spider Man. Thank you. Aww. This is your daddy's. Oh, oh. Oh. Was not expecting that, okay. From the war. Oh, oh wow. you got it. I think it's time to pass it on. Hmm. So who are these people? It's the best present I ever got. Thank you. Oh, that accent. Yeah. All right. How and why people from two points on a map without even a straight line. Oh, was that Haley Bennett? Is at the heart of our story and knock em stiff. Knock em stiff? You ever think about how we ended up orphans living in the same house? I know what my daddy did. Was he a bully? He killed people? Oh, wow. Some people would say it's just dumb luck. <gasps> you take pictures? I do. I see a smile pretty enough to photograph, that is. Oh my God, it's giving me ultra creeps. God's plan. Blessed are they in hunger and thirst for righteousness. That ain't no preacher. He's as bad as they got on the damn radio. Uh-uh. When people look back on it, they ain't had no... Oh, Sebastian Stan, there he is. There's a lot of no good sons of bitches out there. Excuse me, preacher. You got time for a sinner. Oh! You got time for a sinner. It's called the delusion. They believe that is untrue. <gasps> oh! Oh, were those spiders? What? Oh my gosh. Oh my. Some people Whoa. born just so they can be buried. What I'm about to do, I do uh. because I have to. Oh. What? Not because I want to. The Devil All the Time. What an appropriate title, huh? Yeah. Because I was thinking, I was like, oh, okay, interesting. Wow. I like it. I mean, it looks September like... September 16th is when it comes out. Tom Holland is going to be like one of the few good people who's sick and tired of all of these corrupt wow. individuals. And he kind of takes um, justice into his own hands. Um, but, oh... That, that looks so intense. Um, and also, like, top... And I know this is just the trailer, but, like, top-notch acting already. I cannot mm -hmm, wait mm -hmm. to, to, to watch Robert Pattinson in this role. Yeah. Like, it's so good. And just that one moment when he's, like, licking uh, his lips, you're just the, like, oh! The bugs, and then the scene the with the car with the, the woman, I can't even. There are a, There's a lot of good imagery yeah. in this, even though it's creepy, creepy and disturbing and you just kind of, you know, it just makes you shiver all around. It shows what good imagery it is yeah. to be able to just give you that feeling that they want to project throughout, th um, just through the screen. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure they did not even show us the, the best. I, I'm, I'm betting not because they want to keep that under wraps as much as they can mm -hmm. um, before they uh, premiere this on Netflix. But, Kind of going back to ad like novel or book adaptations, I now that I've seen the trailer, I don't know if this is a book that I'm quite ready to kind of like dive into yet because and I love horror and I love horror books, but 
Um, I tend to like to listen to my audiobook at night because I can't sleep. Um, this is not the one to read. I don't know if this is the best one because I remember doing that for like Doctor Sleep and It. I don't think I did that for The Shining. I think I, I think I, I well, yeah, I read The Shining right before like audiobooks. Again, so I haven't really revisited in in that form. But um, it's not. It, it puts. It depends on the person. But my imagination kind of goes wide, wild, and any like little creak and you know thing I hear in the middle of the night, I'm like, what? What's that? What was that? What's that? Pick up and the dog. What is it? it <laughs> you can sense it, right? You can sense me, it. Navi, defend me. She's like, what? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and Navi just gave a woof. <laughs> okay, I'm done. But also the thing is about the book, too, is that usually since they're described, they're able to describe everything to you. The so person's much, so thoughts, much the worse. person's motivations. <gasps> it makes it a lot worse and a lot more creepy and just a lot more wow. kind of a thing. So... I'm kind of interested because this really does look, it looks more of like one of those psycho, uh, psycho, psychedelic, psychedelic, not psychedelic, but psychological more of thriller? a psychological thriller, um, imposed to being like a horror movie. So Oof. I'm interested in seeing this. Yeah, this looks really good. And I have to add that to the list of things we are going to have to watch. I'm glad it's on Netflix uh, yes. because we're, 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 you know, we are subscribed to Netflix. So that's. Really great. Um, yeah, this is a star-studded cast as yes. well. And I, I find it so funny. Like, I feel like most uh, Tom Holland movies I've seen, he doesn't actually speak in his actual accent. His yeah. British accent. Like, you know, the kid, the kid's British, but his the accent's real good. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. Robert Pattinson, too, because I didn't even recognize the voice. Mm -hmm. Didn't even recognize it. And that's something that's always really cool, is that when you see actors step out of that what is that called like that typecasting that they normally have mm -hmm. Robert Pattinson has been trying really 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 hard <laughs> to take these weird obscure roles because um, he really wants to shed that twilight I image of him I think he's done so and he's already. done an amazing he's job he's gonna be Pattinson I mean he's, yeah he's gonna be Batman <laughs> so and also to see um, um, Tom Holland kind of step out of that the Spider-Man um, the Spider-Man yeah. role and it's gonna be cool to see all of these um, actors play di roles that we are not really familiar yeah. with them in. Yeah. So I'm excited to see what um, what this story holds. I'm excited to see what the actors are doing. So this is really cool. I think this gives me extra creeps because Bill Skarsgård's involved in it, and um, he plays uh, Pennywise in in uh, the newer version of, of of it. In case you yeah. didn't know, so I. Because this being a, a thriller, I've already associated the two together. So now I'm like, oh no, I and can't. He, I can't. Even though he doesn't have the full makeup on him. But even without the makeup, he looks creepy. He, he can. He that, can look creepy. That yeah. grin that you're just like. Ugh. Very intense. Well, you guys, that's our. Those are our thoughts on the trailer for The Devil All the Time. Let us know what you think in the comment section below. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye.